Well, Darren, first off, welcome back to Warsaw Football Club, this time in a coaching capacity. You must be really pleased to be back here. Yeah, excited. Um, anyone that knows me knows that Warsaw holds a you know, massive part in my, my heart, really, and uh, I can't wait to get started. Taking part in your first training session today alongside head coach Matt Sadler, uh, assistant coach Gary Waddock and Dan Watson there as well as goalkeeper coach. How did you find that? Yeah, it was good. Um, all made me feel welcome. So uh, it was enjoyable and you know we're, we're all trying to plan to make sure we all work together and help each other to make sure this football club, this football club is successful. You can see already that there's, there's quite a positive atmosphere up there at the training ground at the moment, isn't there? Yeah, lively, um, really excited. You can see the boys all buzzing off each other and encouraging each other and demanding of each other. So um, may, may uh, continue. I was going to say, to, to have that camaraderie already in there, it, it must be quite nice for you to be able to go into that sort of atmosphere as well. Yeah, definitely. It makes it a lot easier um, when the boys are driving each other on. So for me to go in, it's just a warm place and exciting place to be. and. You know, we have to keep driving and doing it day in, day out to make sure the standards don't drop. Talk us through the conversations you had with, with Matt Sadler, which is, you know, convinced you to come here. Well, um, I spoke to him and he knows I'd been here before and um, what I think of the football club. Uh, he spoke about his beliefs, um, he, how he operates and how he wants the team to play. And I was excited from just listening to him speak. I was excited to uh, be a part of it. I think that's something that a lot of the players who've, who've come in so far this pre-season have spoken about just how impressed they've been with him as a head coach and talking to them as people, not just players as well. And that clearly is something that's come across to you as well. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's infectious and um, you want to you be a part of it. You, wanna, you want the club to do well. Uh, you want to help the staff as well as well as the players and, and see where we can end up and uh, we're all on the same page in what we believe can happen at this football club Excite, it's exciting uh, we've been backed from the owners and uh, we've got the gaffer in Matt to to drive us forward you've got many fond memories here uh, as a player will you will you utilize those as extra motivation now as a coach to try and transfer them onto the players that are currently here no, I don't think you really speak about <laughs> your playing career as much. Uh, probably some of them weren't even born. So, But I know what this football club means to me and and the staff. And we, we want to drive the boys and we'll make sure that every day, and I mean every day, that they're running and they're, they're encouraging each other, they're driving each other and they're... You know, they're, they're all on the, we're all on the same page and, you know, we'll speak to each other um, individually collectively so in our units and we'll make sure um, we, we give our best this season we have to and you know what this club means to the supporters as well uh, you know a strong connection with yourself there and it'll be really nice to to be back as part of a coaching setup now in front of them here at the Poundland Bescott Stadium yeah the, the fans it, this is a place wherever I whenever I come here I always feel the love from the fans um, and we've got to give something back and we want to and we all, we all want to, so that's why we'll be giving our best every day, and I mean every day, to make sure we can excite the fans when they know they're coming through the turnstiles to watch this team play, that they're going to see a team that are going to excite them and give their all, and that's what the fans want. You know, obviously we want the three points, but we know we're not going to win every game, but even when we lose or draw, at least the fans can walk away from me and go, Do you know what? They give it their best.